Hello everybody, New Frontier here with Unedited Gaming, and welcome to The Witcher 2 on Xbox 360. I'll be showing you guys how to get the Black Ops achievement, which is to get through the uh, Kidwini camp without being detected. So, as soon as I get to the map here, it's going to be up on your uh, northern, far northern part of the map. Um, this is only available through... Uh, Yorvis uh, quest. Uh, you can't get it with uh, if you side with Roach. So uh, when you get to this crossroads here, you're going to be either um, asked if you want to go through the uh, kind of broken down castle and use the tombs, or uh, go the other way and use uh, basically the uh, the back entrance through the uh, through the camp. So we're going to go and take the uh, back entrance to the Kudwani camp and. You want to kind of you want to keep the trench with all the spikes to your uh, to your left side and uh, kind of just uh, hug that walk all the way down and you're gonna come up onto an uh, an opening in the uh, mountain face. So we're gonna come up here and go to our right. You're gonna want to veer to the left up here and then of course you know your waypoint on your map is going to also show you where to go. Come up here, you want to jump down. As soon as you jump down, you're going to... Uh, or as soon as you jump down here, or across. As soon as you jump across, I think is where you're, uh, you set your, uh, your quest. There it is, where is Trish Marigold? So, now we're gonna reach the tunnels leading to the Nilfgaardian camp. Mind you, this is my first time playing through the game. Uh, I've obviously finished it, I've finished it on Dark. Um, but getting this achievement, this was my first time playing through. So. As you come up here, this guy's gonna come out. You wanna wait for him to come out. He's gonna get a little ways down. Uh, I wanna come through here and I get kinda spooked because I hear somebody talking thinking that someone's gonna come out. But just one guy comes out. Um, also, save. Saving is a good idea. Every time you get to a spot where you think you're safe, uh, go ahead and save. Just in case you do get caught and trigger the guards to uh, come after you, you can just reload your uh, last checkpoint. Hey, run to the harbor, lad. Now, uh, you want to put out the fires when you can, when you are close to them. I don't know if it really helps, but uh, it makes you feel good at least. So when you get up here, that guy had just left, he's going to take that crew down, and they're going to walk away. Now, this guy was kind of weird. Was, didn't really know which angle to, to come up on him. Oh yes, loot. Uh, there's tons of loot and more than enough opportunities to uh, take it all. So go ahead and grab all the loot you can. So I really didn't know, you know, do I come in from the left? Do I come in from the right? But on the left is the uh, is the only path that he won't see you. So go ahead and knock him out. And uh, I recommend every every time there's uh, Three spots on where you knock somebody out that you should uh, just go ahead and save there because you uh, you will be coming up on some uh, some soldiers that you need to either wait for or walk around. So the entrance is actually behind us. Remember, this is my first time going through it, so I really didn't know how to get it. I just knew I just wasn't supposed to be detected. Um, also, this that tent right there, you can go in and there is some uh, some pretty nice uh, armor enhancements and some orins that you can uh, loot. Now as you walk up here, I'm going to you're going to I'm going to look to my left real quick and there's a guard right there in the back. Now he actually starts closer up to that ramp. And uh, you're going to have to wait if he's there, just wait for him and he'll make his way down. Um, just wait for him to get farther enough down where you feel comfortable and then go ahead and head through that door. So now we're uh, we're just about halfway through. There's going to be a group of guards. You want to wait for them. Uh, once they pass the uh, the campfire there to your left, it's pretty safe to just go ahead and uh, to go. You see, I pass a lot of loot there. I'm kind of scared, but you know, in this game, as you're walking by, just keep tapping A, and you'll you'll automatically pick it up here. So 
a couple weird things happened to me. I saved here in the corner, um, which I can tell you guys now, don't save here in the corner. Just make it down. You're gonna you're gonna walk a little ways down, and you're gonna come up to a cook. Um, you cannot avoid him seeing you, but as you do come up on him, he uh, you're gonna cast a spell, which basically you kind of uh, take over. You Jedi mind trick him and. Uh, basically tell him that he's tired and that he should go to sleep so that he doesn't uh, tell the guards on you. So I do get caught here. Um, I kind of left it in just so you can see that you can restart the checkpoint and uh, you can still get the achievement. So I'm kind of tripping here because I think there's supposed to be some loot inside this chest and there's not so I'm uh, not very happy. I'm not taking no for an answer but Again, it is random loot, uh, so, you know, you could have something in there, you could not. So, uh, when you come in here, as soon as you get to about the second tent right there is when the guys are coming. I should be looking left, but I'm kind of looking right, and whoops, they got me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to reload my last save. And what happens here is, for some reason, this guard sees me instantly as the, uh, as the game... Uh, restarts from the load and I must have restarted the game 10 times every time it would load up uh, the, the guards saw me and they, they instantly triggered their their little scene where where they come after me and I've got to fend for myself and would have lost the achievement so I kept restarting kept restarting and um, to me, you're, you're gonna see it where it's just I, I didn't do anything I barely moved and instantly had to take out my sword so in between this little cut right here, uh, I did have to load the game uh, almost 10 times. So uh, we're going to do it one final time here, and as soon as it comes up, should have edited it a little bit more. Sorry guys, you know I'm still new at this, so uh, I will get better as time goes on. Um, still loading. Still loading. Game's got some pretty long loads, but it is great. Don't pass this game up. This is an awesome game. So, okay, look, no problem. So now I've reloaded this game tons of time. I'm kind of freaking out. Um, I'm gonna kind of go back and forth, to try and see. Oh, there's the armor enhancement, the steel armor plate that that showed up in the in the uh, in the chest. So now I'm stoked. I got it. And. Uh, I'm trying to like slowly come up here to see if I can get the guards to trigger and uh, and not get caught. So what do I do? Well, I saved because I've got there safely. I haven't triggered any guards to to notice my position and I wanted to really I wanted to get away from that other save that just was not being nice to me at all. So it's right as soon as you get to this second tent, you'll uh, you'll trigger those guards to come out. Um, there's, a, there's a fair amount, I want to say there's about five or six guards that come out of there. And uh, we are put out the campfire. Again, I don't know if it's going to do anything, but it makes you feel good. So here we are, we're on the home stretch. There's some more loot you can pick up. Uh, good for a couple orns. Don't over encumber yourself. But uh, here we got one guy on our right to take out. Give him a nice blow to the head. And there we go. It's uh, achievement time. So I'll go ahead and pick up a circle of power there, of endurance I mean. Come around the corner. As soon as you come out of your little stealth mode and you start sprinting, we're going to come down here into the tunnels. And boom. There it is. Achievement unlocked. Black Ops for 20 Gs. So, there you go. Hope this helped, guys. Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. Uh, again, I'm still learning how to do this. Uh, they'll get better as time goes on, but uh, please check back for more achievement videos and playthroughs. And again, thanks for coming. Bye.